Floppy. What? I had Batman's right leg and a young man's right leg encompassed in my microphone. You're kidding. Well, in the court, I should say. Can you believe this, boys and girls? We actually have Batman here with us today, and I'm going to get a few choice words from Batman, if I can infringe upon this conversation here. What were you talking about, uh, we uh, were, Batman? Uh, I, I know it's rude, but uh -huh. we were talking about Floppy. You were? Yes. Hey, what were you saying? Be behind his ear. Uh -huh. uh, well, I was just asking uh, what kind of a dog he is. Uh -huh. uh, we have a pet dog in the Bat Cave. You do have? Yes. Floppy is a, uh, what we call a bugle. Uh -huh. Yes, a combination I, I beagle hear, hear and loudmouth, which boils down to bugle. You see, oh. isn't that novel? Yes, it is. Uh -huh. Batman. I can. <laughs> Batman is being told that he's on camera right now. Batman, I do hope you'll stay for just a few <coughs> moments while we watch a cartoon, and then we'll talk further. Thanks, okay? Dwayne. I like that very much. I'm enjoying it here. Okay, fine. Here is our first cartoon. Where? There. Well, as you know, with the Floppy Show, we always like to devote a certain amount of time to something educational. Huh? Something educational. Oh, that. Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh-huh. And there's been a lot of comment about our educational bits that we've had on television. Really? Yes. A lot of people have been saying, why do you have those? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when you could be having more cartoons and things like that. But we just go ahead and have them anyway. And uh, so I hope that you enjoy this c dissertation by Floppy concerning cats and dogs. Cats. Yuck! And dogs. I am told Yuck. there is great disagreement between cat lovers and dog lovers as to which is the more desirable animal. I would like to point out that dog is superior and cat is inferior. For example, here are two cats. Cat is spelled C-A-T. And note the scruffy, unattractive ears, the low criminal forehead, the beady, vicious eyes, the sarcastic sneer, the arrogant leer, the obvious look of a ruthless killer. And now look at man's best friend, the dog, spelled D-O-G. The open, honest face, obedient and cheerful, always ready to get master slippers and newspaper, a cuddly, loyal bundle of love. I hope my speech makes it clear that dogs are sweet and cats are troublemakers. And now, excuse me, but I gotta go chase some cats. I just love to chase cats. Anybody know where I can find some cats? Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Well, Batman, uh, no, it, it, the cameras are out this way. Well, I'm uh, not used to being on television, I'll tell you that. <laughs> uh, the floppy show. Uh-huh, yeah. I saw your truck outside. Did you really? Yes, the van. That's how I found the studio. Uh-huh. I've got a special device in the Batmobile that A.J. was using because I gave him a ride down here. Oh, yes, and that is? That he was robbing for a day. Was he oh, really? it's a te bat telescope that uh, really gets out there and zings in on oh. anything I wanted to find. Did you notice it's a special that, heat process? Did you notice that the floppy mobile needs washing? Did you <laughs> notice that? Well, I, uh, yes, I didn't want to say it. Actually, I'm parked. <laughs> I parked the Batmobile next door at the muffler shop, and uh, if they can do it in four minutes, I should have a new <laughs> muffler. Do you have a watch under there? I noticed that you were looking at your wrist. Uh, uh, no, Batman. but uh, no. Robin a, bit me a, this morning. And <laughs> A bionic wrist is what he has. That I was checking time. the watch because crime fighters, as you uh, <clears throat> super bat fans know, you oh, junior okay. crime fighters, uh -huh. we are on camera. Oh, absolutely. We're being seen uh -huh, yes. via uh, Telstar in, yeah, all well, over. At least. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Well, crime fighters are very specific about things like time. Uh -huh. We have to be. Also, AJ, no sign yet, huh? AJ, AJ, may I talk to AJ Please. for just a moment? AJ, I understand that you actually rode to the studio today. I'm talking like you. I've got to, well, I've, me, I've lost to my personality, up. totally. Well, I, I shouldn't <laughs> wish to be conspicuous. <laughs> we, <laughs> I'm gonna start talking like myself again. Uh, I understand oh, that you oh, actually yeah. rode with uh, Batman to the studio. Today. Yes, I did. Uh, in the Batmobile? Yeah. Uh-huh. And uh, what, how would you describe the Batmobile? Careful. <laughs> 
Does it just flow with great uh, smoothness down the street? No. <laughs> what? What? Really now? Really? Well, you I mean uh, to say that you had no. a little motor trouble with the Batmobile? Oh, certainly not, uh, Dwayne. But uh, what I did, I tried to give this young crime fighter a couple of thrills uh -huh. on the way here <laughs> by <laughs> pressing a few levers uh -huh. and making the car perform a uh -huh. bit, just a taste of the bat you turn uh -huh. and some of the flame that comes out of the rear end. And you made the motor miss a couple of times. <laughs> made the motor miss a couple. Actually, uh, I could, pre you know, it's a fascinating car because we've de developed it over the years where I can really just pull a small lever, yes. toggle switch like, mm -hmm. and it will change the tires. Really? Yes, we don't have to Woo. stop, get out of the Batmobile, nothing old fashioned like that. Fantastic. As a matter of fact, don't stand too close uh, to my utility belt, Floppy. Oh, yeah. Because it's. <laughs> It's full of very dangerous, highly sophisticated crime-fighting equipment. Uh -huh. And I'd hate to have anything go off. I know, I, I know what you're saying there. We appreciate your consideration in that yeah. regard. Uh, you're, Would you you're, like to... You're a wild... Touch my bat. bat. <laughs> Don't go ahead. It. I like it. Okay, now we have Batman. Uh, I mean, we have four passes for A.J. Drew and one for yourself to get into the fabulous auto. <laughs> you think I'll need it? I might after this show. I, uh, <laughs> no, uh, I'll tell you what. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're right. We do have four complimentary tickets. Uh, to whom do they go? They go to A.J. here. <laughs> A.J.? May I present them with uh, you, sir? Uh -huh. Congratulations. I'll see you down at Autorama probably this evening because I'll be there before 7. And I'll be spending three hours meeting all my Bat fans down there, shaking hands, telling stories. Uh, mommies will get a kiss. Uh -huh. uh, I'll pet the dogs. Uh huh. No, but I really do want to get acquainted with all of you Bat fans, and I'll be there for three days, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday at right. the Veterans Auditorium. Okay. Dwayne, um, we have a complimentary ticket for you and for Floppy. Uh huh. Good. <laughs> if he hasn't eaten it. But. <laughs> Well, uh, we're, we're happy to have that complimentary ticket. Well, I hope that you'll be there because uh, the show is full of surprises. Yeah, I can well imagine. Mm -hmm. And the Batmobile will be on display. It has its winter coat now. Does it really? Yes. It, uh, we have a short uh, fur-like material that we put on the Batma uh, Batmobile. Uh, AJ said it was felt. <laughs> <laughs> well, Probably it is quite a uh, bit, similar uh, to felt. Uh, uh, it's probably being felt right Quite now a bit, yes. in the muffler lot. It's Actually, you right. kids will be able to feel it uh, mm -hmm. this weekend. <laughs> Ask me any questions you'd like, and uh -huh. uh, I look forward to getting acquainted with you all in person. Well, I, I think you're going to be amazed at the turnout that uh, you have there at the Veterans Auditorium. Thank you, Dwayne. I want to tell you before I leave, if I may, how much Robin and Alfred and I have enjoyed your show mm -hmm. in the Bat Cave. Yes. Uh, in the afternoons, we... Uh, uh, normally take that time to dust the bat computers yes. to adjust our atomic pile uh -huh. and uh, we we uh, try to watch you as often as we can and it's nice to see you kids again too. Robin was here a year ago on this very program. Yes, he told me about it for weeks. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> and he said that you were kind of bossy at times. I don't think there's any truth in that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you never assert yourself in any way, huh? Uh, well, I try not to, but sometimes it's necessary, I think, uh, especially when you have the great responsibility of bringing up a junior crime fighter. Yes, I can well imagine. And uh, I, I really, I started to say to A.J., I asked him a question if uh, he'd seen any signs yet. Remember, A.J., and the, the Penguin or Riddler or Joker? Oh, yes. And, and because it's rumored that they're here in Des Moines. No. Yes, this weekend, and I'm actually here on a case. Wow. You have any remarks to make about that, A.J.? No. Uh-huh. He didn't fill too much there for us uh, with that, but we want to congratulate him. Holy <laughs> <laughs> We, we, uh, we for, I don't know if we even mentioned that this young man was the lucky winner in our uh, Batman drawing, and uh, Batman brought him to the studio today uh, with the motor missing once in a while. But actually, uh, if you look inside the hood, 
we have a special engine. It's uh, charged by the atomic pile. It works on batteries. <laughs> and it's very silent and very smooth. And However, I like to make a little joke occasionally. Uh, <laughs> that, I, that's a, a kind of a droll kind of a person that you are, Batman, with your little touches of humor now and then. Well, I think, um, you know, it's a great relief to me to <laughs> do things like this because uh, it takes a great deal of energy and concentration, enthusiasm to fight crime. Yes, I'm sure it is. But I think it's uh, terribly important for all of us. Yes. But to take a break occasionally and come in here and see you and floppy. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll all be seeing you at the Autorama at the Veterans Auditorium. Okay, okay? kid. Nice yeah. meeting you, floppy. Really. Thank you. Thanks, Dwayne. Now let's have A.J. say, here's our next cartoon as he takes ham, hams with uh, Batman. Here's the next cartoon. They're taking hams to right rip. now. <laughs> Well, boys and girls, we had a most unusual program today, and we did have Batman on the program, and now I got my regular voice back. I, I have this terrible tendency to start trying to sound like whoever I'm interviewing. I notice that. But uh, boys and girls, you all have a sack of junk to take home with you today, and uh, we hope that you'll enjoy that in your leisure. Right. <laughs> And we hope you all go to the auto Rama. I'll do it. Okay, time for Floppy to say, so long, kids. Goodbye, Floppy. Floppy.